this is the desire for flawless skin. And nature has always been a friend. Introducing Apsara Skin Care, made with all natural ingredients for all skin types. Bringing ancient wisdom into modern skin care. Visit ApsaraSkinCare.com today. Go natural. It's good karma. I'm Sue Davy, and today I'm excited to be here with Sheetal, the founder of AppsaraSkinCare.com. And Sheetal is going to teach us a recipe for a skin mask for a combination skin with pure, natural, vegan ingredients. And I believe they're derived from Ayurveda tradition, is that correct? That is right. Every, um, you know, Apsara product or, or even the ingredients that get used in these at-home skincare recipes, um, I try very hard at that they are as true to the Ayurvedic uh, tradition as right. possible. So right. right. And it's very simple. I see only three ingredients here. And keeping it simple is also helpful because then nobody gets overwhelmed and most mm -hmm. of these ingredients are available in the kitchen counter. So one doesn't really have to go hunting for them very much either. Great. So yeah, simpler the better. Wonderful. So what are we using? Um, today I'm going to share with you a recipe for combination skin and we are going to create a facial mask to nourish and balance combination skin. So we're using three ingredients, one tablespoonful of rice flour and to this we are going to add about four to six drops of extra virgin olive oil. And if you get, as I always say, if you get a couple of drops extra, it doesn't really matter. Oh, that's nice. And um, enough rose water to form a paste. Now, if you don't have rose water at home, you can always use pure water as well. Great. Uh, just tap water. Okay. That should be okay. And now you're going to mix these three ingredients very well until a paste is formed. Mm -hmm. And then this paste as a facial mask, now it goes on your skin and sits on your skin for about let's say 10 minutes or so it doesn't usually take it more than 12 minutes to dry great 10 to 12 minutes and once it's dry you're going to wash your skin and you are going to follow with serum and lotion right after so it's very simple and elegant but these very simple um, ingredients have great skincare benefits Wonderful. Uh, rice flour soaks up oil, it cuts oil. So with combination right. skin, you know that you have an oily T-zone. Yes. And extra virgin olive oil nourishes parts of your skin that are either dry mm -hmm. or um, that are normal even. I see. And if you're going to use rose water, rose water has wonderful astringent properties, ah. very highly regarded in Ayurveda for its skin tightening, pore tightening wonderful. properties. So the T-zone that has open pores mm -hmm. tends to have open pores gets covered that way. Perfect. Um, and it's very refreshing also. Yes. Very fragrant. Perfect. It smells wonderful. So this is wonderful for those of us who have combination skin to lift the oil and to nourish. That's right. But can this mask be used by any skin type or is it just for us with the combination skin? It's good for combination skin, but any other skin type can use it too. You mm -hmm. see it has ingredients that are universal. The rose water, for instance, will it's a good astringent. Yes. The extra virgin olive oil has so many essential fatty acids mm -hmm. and so many wonderful proteins. Your skin loves it. Right. So really, no matter what skin type you have, you could use it. Perfect. So, well, thank you so much for teaching us this simple Ayurvedic vegan recipe, and I'm excited to try the mask. Absolutely. Thank you so much. Thank you.